All right, folks, how you doing? So here are the uh, images of the Sphinxes at Charlotte Square. Uh, just where you find the statue of Prince Albert. There he is. And look at that. That's very clearly the Sphinx. And there's loads of them. That one there is in, uh, in Parliament Square. But that one, you've got the pyramid in the background there. That's definitely in Charlotte Square. You know, so you've got the pyramid in the background and the Sphinx in the foreground, you know, as if to make it any more obvious what you're looking at. And this image here is of the Sphinx's surrounding queen victoria so these people knew what their bloodline was they knew what their lineage was that one again is charlotte square again with a pyramid in the background but it's something that i completely forgot about and went completely over my head at the time especially when you look at this image i wonder how i forgot this but there is a pyramid in scotland you know in fact there's the proto pyramid there's mesau up on the orkney islands but you know i mean an actual pyramid pyramid you find up at Balmoral, and uh, I'll point that out momentarily when I remember how to use this technology. <laughs> Hang on. Uh, so here we are, Scotland Pyramid. So you can see here um, these pyramids. You might wonder, well, where's this pyramid? Well, it's up at Balmoral. This is the secret Scottish pyramid in Cairngorms National Park or the Great Pyramid of Scotland, the odd tail behind the Scots Pyramid in the Highlands. And then when you look into it, it's actually dedicated to Prince Albert. So not only has he got sphinxes surrounding a statue in Charlotte Square, but there's a big pyramid dedicated to him in the Scottish Highlands. You know, and uh, what can I speak cannot lie? I mean, you can see it with your own eyes. It's very distinct. It stands out in the landscape. You know, uh, there we go. That's what I was looking for. Prince Albert's Cairn. I mean, literally spelled out for you. <laughs> you know, these bloodlines know who they are. You know, definitely 100%. Uh, and also, I was thinking of that as well just a second ago the Star Pyramid in Stirling, you know, um, which is very similar just outside Stirling Castle. You've also got the Pyramid shaped mountain as well. I mean, there is the argument that a pyramid is just essentially an artificial mountain. I don't know how much validity that holds but you know that is a theory you know and here again you've got the um the prince albert cairn uh, and it's right there to the beloved memory of albert the great and good prince consort erected by his broken-hearted widow victoria 1862 you know um we're going to be getting a lot more into this in the future but you know just wanted to make this point because somehow this went over my head earlier on. I don't know how I forgot this. But, you know, in the end, um, it came back to me. Look at that. Right in the middle of the countryside. Visiting the Balmoral. You can visit it. Well, I need to look into that. <laughs> uh, what's this? Uh, ancient aliens and mystery and all this. Uh, oh, that's from uh, Reddit, isn't it? I don't really pay that much attention to Reddit, to be honest. And, um, yeah, Scotland Secret Pyramid. I mean, yeah. How to visit Prince Albert's Cairn in Scotland. I didn't know that you could visit it. <laughs> I'll have to look at that. There we go. So anyway, hope you enjoyed this uh, video and thanks for watching.